And here we are. We're back, everybody. We're gonna play some more Fool's Gold today now. So, I think the next thing I wanted to do before I move on to the next gym is I wanted to explore the new areas. But, of course, let's make sure we go to the side first. I'm gonna go take a... Yeah, I'm gonna go explore from the from the right side first. I just have to hop on over through here. Thanks for getting this up there, friend. So last time, of course, I was training... Yeah, I started training Porygon. I got Por uh, Poliwhirl and Aridos there. Mantike and Togepi. Oh yeah, I gotta talk to the Kanto guy, too. We can do that in a little bit. For now, let's head up here. I can use Surf, so we can go to explore. I want to see what's different up here. Energy roots. Ugh. Mantike and Togepi are there to gather friendship. Just because. And there's grass now, so let's see what we can run into. Darn, is it still too loud, chat, or is the game audio good? It was really, really loud when I booted it up. Porygon apparently needs to get level 30-something. Before I hit Porygon 2. Yeah, I believe it's like level up for Porygon 2 and then an item for Z. Are Hoenn Pokemon here? Not quite sure. You don't have to explore these new areas. You can ignore them, I believe, but... I want to take a look. Yeah, there are boosted shiny odds in this. Next three seven there. Appreciate it. There's a trainer. I only use powerful Pokemon. Free max revive, but I don't want to use energy root on friendship mons, of course. Oh, yeah, you. The grass dragon. How's your special attack, though? Or special defense, I should say. Thanks, everybody, for subbing now. I appreciate that. I get stabbed from Swift, but it looks like it might not be enough. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's gonna pile up on me. I should be fine. I should tank another one. Unless it's a crit. Boost me right up to 24. Ah, I'm hoping this Porygon works out. Tauros. This thing was Psychic-type. So, let's send out Ariados and hit it with Shadow Punch. That should be safe. The goofy looking back spray for Ariados, even though its front sprite looks pretty sick. It's not normal psychic, is it? I hope not. It is? Oh, man. Well, infestation should still be super effective, even if I'm gonna die now, though. Everything's part normal type in this game. Nor they're either part normal or they're part ghost. I don't make the rules. I was hoping he'd go for a different attack, stupidly. Oh, I lived. Batoros will die. Bullied. Damn, that's a lot for Porygon. Sharpen, you don't need that. Yeah, we'll get rid of you. Cool trainer. Marl's about to use Arcanine. Uh... Ice fire still. Let's see what we can do here. Oh yeah, that thing. I remember this now. Don't think this is a new new um I don't think this is a new sprite. Let's just go for a dig. Hit him with that. Adjust the volume again. Sounds good. Sounds good. I can't tell if it's too loud, just because like every time I switch to like a Gen 2 game, they're just, just so obnoxiously loud. Or rather Game Boy games in general. I end up having to crank the audio settings a lot lower than normal. Alright, Icy Wind sure as hell did a lot, but that's okay. Because I doubt you have Earthquake. Imagine if it had, like, a, any, like, real ice moves. Icy Wind can almost kill me, just imagine. Perfect. So apparently Polyrath is by level, so I'm going to be keeping this on the team and just wait until it evolves. 
Right now it's morning for in-game time. Alright. There's an Orion tail. Okay, and there's another potato. We, however, shall be ignoring the potato like usual. Or rather, not catching it right now. Oh. Oh, it digs. Of course it does. I don't have time to play with that. Want to see my rare Pokemon? Thank you, everybody. I appreciate it. Cool trainer Lucas sent out Scizor. Okay, he's got the punch bug. That thing will mess me up pretty hard. Just send out for alligator. It'll die to a flying move. Absolutely. Mock punch. Easy. Mock punch, meet mock speed. It's deadly. A Ralligator should be strong enough to kill most anything. As long as it doesn't, like, resist. Oh, you got Togetic. Um, did I have anything for this right now? Porygon would have been good if it wasn't at low health. Damn, how annoying. May as well switch and let Mantite get levels. How about that? I'm probably not going to end up using the Manti Mantike, but, um, like, it's shiny, but at the same time, it's like, I already have a flying type. It's going to be way better. Bulldoze. No, it ain't hitting me. Like, my starter is probably, is just, like, absolutely just better than the Mantine. Even if it is an odd egg shiny, it's like, I don't really want it. Like, I'll keep it with me and evolve it, I guess. Because I think uh, Mantine is actually, um... It's a 1% encounter in National Park during the day, I believe. So I may as well just hang on to it and get that done. Just keep it with me, buff the friendship, and we'll be fine. Hitmonchan was a fire type. I wonder if I can get away with uh, killing it, if it doesn't have Mach Punch. Or any kind of priority move. I just want to go with it with Poliwhirl here. Yeah, it had Mach Punch still. Okay. Oh well. I'll just switch out the Togepi so the Togepi can have a boost of friendship from levels 2. I should be strong enough. Now that I have access to this area, though, I'm gonna assume that going through here was probably be in my best interest to get experience for the upcoming gyms. Oh, it's fire fighting. Okay, it's still part fighting, I forgot. Tokepi gained 420. Tokepi got multiple levels. Tokepi learned tackle. Well, Trainer Lucas was defeated. Too hot for this. It's mom. Hey, how are you? I found a useful item. I bought it with your money. Sorry, it's in the PC. <laughs> Thanks a lot, mom. All right. Uh, hang on. I ha think I have to mute this. Okay. Yeah, it's Lavender Town. It's Lavender Town music, so I gotta mute it. And now I'm in here, where it's naturally silent. Hello, H and WWW, W, welcome, we to our Poke, Poke, PK, Moon Center, R. We 33 can he ate Al, Pokemon, PK, MQN, to per, perfect, fect, health, T, 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 capital T, 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 H, H. Shall we heal your MN Pokemon? Okay. May I? Spooky. Thank you, FQR. Wait, 444 four, four, TGNNG. Your Pokemon are FU1LYH yield. We hope to see you again. 
That's what she said. All right, cool. Now let's go over here. It'd be spooky around here, chat. Glitch. I can't read what that says. Nurse Joy wants to battle. <laughs> and now it has a devil egg. Shouldn't have let her hear your, po hear your Pokemon. I need a physical move for this. Poliwhirl, get in there. <laughs> this place is creepy, chat. It's rather spooky indeed. Be careful. You'll get spooked forever. I don't think I ever saw what Blissey looks like. And Happini's in this game now, too. Oh yeah, it's Poison Dark, not just Pure Dark. Didn't realize it would be super effective, I just wanted a physical attack. Aerodactyl, um... I'll send in Porygon and switch. But that's definitely an Aerodactyl. What else would it be, chat? I can't tell. <laughs> Could you tell? And then there was hyper-realistic blood coming out of the Aerodactyl's eyes. That's not good. That's not good at all. Ah, confusion sucks. Well, it still has ancient power, but looks like I can redeem. Oh no! It got the it got the ancient power boost, and it's gonna get it again. Just watch. No, okay. Wow, I'm going to die to this. Cool, cool. Oh, great. Okay, Ariados, you get in there. I'm gonna get slaughtered. Uh. I'm only had Shadow Sneak to finish it off. Okay, good, I got the crit. I really needed that. Already I got some change there too. Dratini. I think this was poison type, if I'm remembering, so Polyworld can do this. Well, it's got a needle, so maybe a poisonous one? We'll find out. Maybe this place is why I lost all my Pokemon last time. That would be bad. Nurse Joy defeated. O I S S 4 L C 8 question mark 1 1 R G V S R left arrow T. Got 480. Alright, let's go back and heal. Oh, yeah, there's some counters here. Hello, Magnemite. Don't necessarily want you right now, but... Like, I remember everything here had, like, really annoying catch rates. So I might just have to come back later. With, like, Ultra Balls and stuff. I'm gonna be keeping Hypnosis on Poliwhirl, because Sleep has been pretty good for helping catch things. Can't use the bike in here. That'd be nice. We'd go a lot faster if that was the case. Hello, trainer. I am a normal Nurse Joy. Would you like to have your Pokemon healed? Did we? S I'm pretty sure we saw what Dragonite looked like last time, didn't we? We hope to see you again. You shouldn't have done that. You shouldn't have come here, player. You should have stayed away. You should have stayed far, far away. Asprey. 
It said my name, chat. It said my name. Full heal. I am so spooked right now. Oh, hello, Magby. Close to Magmar, are ya? I'll YOLO ball it, but... I remember trying to catch one of these before and it just would not get in the damn ball. Darn. Let's... Oh, I can't escape. Alright, I'm just gonna let Polyworld do it then. How about that? The Magby family is now poisonous, I guess. Oh god, I don't even want to imagine what Magmordar looks like. Jeez. That's how gross the baby looks. I need access to lots of Ultra Balls. I think I either... I don't get those until Blackthorn is when I can regularly buy them, I think. B. J. C. G. N. B. A. C. L. A. Here she comes! Nurse Joy would like to battle. Okay, you got a coughing. Got a scary balloon. It's only level 20. Should be able to hit with Surf. I don't think I've seen any of the Electabuzz family. I don't know- I don't remember seeing it last time, so I don't know what type it is. I wonder what they do for Electivire. Coughing. Send it out, I guess. I can take these. Did I ever end up seeing Weezing either? I'm not quite sure. Well, at least these are easy to kill. Porygon is doing A-OK -okay right now. For a random Pokemon, I kind of just decided to, to use because Surf? Why not? It can evolve a few times in this game, so I'm sure it'll be all right. Ariados. Let my Ariados kill it. Look at that thing, chat. Look how spooky that looks. And look how goofy it looks from on the down sprite. Or the back sprite. I don't know why I said down sprite, but... How buffed from the normal Porygon family is uh, th this Porygon? Like, does it have any difference to base stats? Shadow Ball. You don't need that, though. I mean... I could put it over Scary Face, I guess, for extra PP, but your attack power is way better. There's no reason for you to have Shadow Ball. I-L-Y-U dot E... Uh... P-Q-K-E-B-T-M-T -T, exclamation mark HP bar. Red encounter. At least this is an easy thing to kill. I don't run out of surfs. I wonder how they ha ha handle location evolutions. There's probably a stone for that. D, Q, left arrow, X equals T, 8, K, N, Pokemon, Y, I, 7, question mark, question mark, P, K, X. What riddles do you speak to me? R, X, T, 2, D, S, T, P, T, 8, 2, P, and V, slash, bracket. Here comes another one, chat. Nurse Joy would like to battle. There's a spooky ghost. Powered up orphan. This thing wasn't still part ground, I don't think. Headbutt. 
I don't know what sounds I'm supposed to make when the, the text box is filled with, like, the corner of a plant graphic. <laughs> I'm not sure what I can even say there. Thanks for something there, Purple. Ampharos. Uh, we haven't seen this, but it's go gotta be Ghost-type. Did I see Ampharos last time? Oh, I remember that, actually. Yes. Okay. So at level 25, isn't that illegal? Super effective. Damn, that's a lot. Asprey versus right arrow. F, D, D, Q, F, T, and... I'm not sure how I'm supposed to make sounds out of that instead of saying the letters. Please use the dead sheep. I don't really want to. I already have a ghost type on my team. Ariados is a is like a monster. I love it. This is probably the first time in my life that I actually like using Ariados for anything. Let me just get this here. I'm a little bit stuffy. Yeah, Ariados has plus 10 to all of its stats, compared to normal one. Nothing stopping you from catching your own sheep. BNMD, question mark, R, Y, Y, N, V, bracket, 0, 8, N, G, and whatever all that is. I think I saw the corner of a PC. Nurse Joy wants to battle. Oh, there's Murkrow. I don't know if I want the Charmander, though. I took it last time, so I want to take something different. Uh-oh. That's not good. I don't remember what types the other two were. I think Charmander was Fire Dark. Which was cool, but... I meant to switch, and I mashed the button. Oh, well. Goodbye, Porygon. All right, then. I think Ariados is about to level up. Just nightshade it. Squirtle was dragon. Wasn't, like, the Bulbasaur electric or something? Nurse Joy's about to send out the giraffe. Ah, that's bad for me. I'll let Poliwhirl do this. How about that? Wait, oh, the Squirtle's Water Dragon. Well, I already have a Water type. Hmm. And Bulbasaur's Fire Grass. I don't know if I really like that typing. Um. I think having the Charizard might actually be better typing for me, though. Because. <laughs> hmm. Oh, this is annoying. Let me do this, then. Because I last time, I had the same issue where I needed a fire type. Because the available fire types I wasn't finding very good or didn't really want to use. I might want the Charizard on my team as, like, an actual, like, mainstay, uh, like, Pokemon to fight. The other ones, I just probably, like, fill out the decks and box them. I'm trying other stuff right now. Alright, I'm gonna let the Slow King come out. Confusion should go away. <sighs> Darn it. Well, it definitely can't hit me with electric moves, so at least that's good. Other stuff uses Charizard again. Hey, in my defense, the game, I didn't get to keep the Charizard for very long until the. What the hell is the move execution? Excuse me? That's rather ominous. Good thing it didn't hit me. Blobs. Five. B. 
B D R G K K. I imagine it's probably similar to Guillotine, yeah. Do I have a revive? Because I don't feel like going back to heal Porygon. Hi, Remo Raid. Remo Raid needs to go far, far away from me. Far, far away from me. Did I have... I think I bought some revives. Let me check here. Yeah, I got two. Okay. I can use some stuff that was different from before, chat. You can catch all the star all the all of them later elsewhere. SRS left arrow S M three VK question mark seven. <laughs> show for alligators front, I can show it again, I guess. Alright. There's Octillery. Now, I believe this thing is, like, Poison-type. Hang on. Drown it. Critical hit. Good. Good. Nurse Joyce about to use Pupitar. Haven't seen that before. Send it out. Oh, I think I vaguely recall that. Now then. Uh, alright, let me show the for alligator if you haven't seen it. It turned into a plane, which is, uh, a very interesting design choice, I guess. Not really how I would have ended the evolution line, but... <laughs> I got bit, chat. It does kind of look like a mole, don't it? Alright. I don't remember what type this thing was. Is it pure dark, or is it something else? Like dark ghost? Neutral hit on ghost attacks. Well, good enough for now. That's some high attack stat there, Ariados. 7 0 pack poke level TX PWPK question mark in the corner. Alright, time for more potions. I gotta use up some of my inventory anyway. This is fine. Like these orange berries, I'm not gonna use them as real held items anymore. May as well fill out the slot. Give that to uh, Holly World, because why not? There's the poison slugma. Just hit it with another surf, I guess. It's now a sludgma, that's right. Is there anything back here? Item. Alright, let's get him. Oh, I still can't run away? Oh, don't poison me. Don't poison me, lad. Alright, I'm just gonna send out Poliwhirl now. It got Mock Punch because it needed that, clearly. Only a little bit for it. It's fine, though. Gotta go, friend. Alright, see you later. Berserk Gene. You know, just find that laying around because... I got one antidote. Guess I'm using on Porygon now. Oh, we're at the end. 
A voice inside your head compels you to get inside the machine. Wait! Don't get inside the machine. I see the look of confusion on your face. I was once a regular trainer like you. Like you. I came here to train my Pokemon and was compelled to get inside this tank. I got in and fell unconscious. But I woke up and noticed my body was that of a Nurse Joys. I quickly realized what was happening and busted myself out. Hey, while I'm here, I'll unlock this door for you. I'm gonna stick around and try to figure out how to get back into my old body. Maybe I'll see you again someday. Alright. I can't check the pod anyway, can I? Another Magnemite. Wait, I just realized I don't have an empty move I uh, Pokemon slot. I think there's a PC up ahead, actually. I can interact with it, but nothing happens. Togepi away for a moment. Will you take Charmander, the fire Pokemon? Will you take Squirtle, the water Pokemon? Will you take Bulbasaur, the grass Pokemon? Alright, I'm taking the Charmander again. Charmander gives me the coverage I want. I also really liked the Charmander last time, too. Can't take any of the other ones for some reason. The other ones I can catch later. Oh, hang on a second, chat. Lavender Town, Lavender Town. Here we are. So... Oh, there's a ledge there, that's why. Alright, let me just go heal my Pokemon right quick. Let me just get out of Tumbleweed Town before I activate the music again. I should probably check the, the Charmander's stats. Maybe it's shiny, for all I know. I think they all got new signature moves, too. Nice. Hang on. Let me get out of town first. Um, actually, that route's kind of long. Let me head back and go back to Ecrotique now. Okay. Alright, sound's back. We're not getting claimed on Lavender Town today. Level 20. Nope, no shiny. Growl, Ember, Smoke Screen, Bite. Ugh. There's a fly buzzing in my face. Okay. Higher special attack. It's Fire Dark. And let me check Pokedex. Oh, there's Aerodactyl chat. Type is question mark. Area. Found at Mount Silver, of course. Okay. Oh, hang on. There it is. Its skin is clear as a result of a lack of sunlight. The fire on its tail is very dim, but still hot. Can't find it in Johto. Alright. Now what was I gonna do? I should probably start by getting Charmander one level so it becomes Charmeleon. Unless they change the levels required for that. Let's head back. And then we, we gotta go get the Kanto Pokemon of the day, chat. We gotta go get that. All right, little Charmander, your time to shine. Light things on fire. No, Charmander's not on the verge of death. It's just a cave salamander in this game.
It's a cute little friend too, isn't it? We're gonna play the gotcha game. Heck yeah, we are. Yeah, if only you didn't take so much damn damage while fighting a rodent. No! You waste my time, rodent. You waste my time. Alright, let's go back now. <laughs> Great. Wonderful. Hop into Ecritique. I'm gonna heal at the Pokemon Center, put Mantike away, and we're gonna go get the Kantomon, chat. We're gonna get the Kantomon. I didn't end up doing the bug catching contest last time, did I? I kind of forgot. It's not a big deal. It's probably better if I wait till I have Polyrath so I can use Hypnosis, actually. Unless putting them this does putting them to sleep affect your score in any way? I don't know. Sorry, Paper Towel. I, I genuinely don't think I'm going to be using the Mantine chat. I, my flying type is... I already have a way better one. No real reason for me to. Getting fly from Cienwood today would be good. But we got the Charmander now, so that's also nice. Only remaining HP effect score. Well, he's standing there, so I guess I can do it today. Bug catching is today, yeah. So I can talk to him. Later. Now then. Actually, doesn't didn't Arnie want to rebattle? Maybe I can uh, use Charmander there for a quick level. If I spawn the awesome Pokemon, I'll be sure to give you a call. Oh, I guess he doesn't want to rebattle now. Did I do that last time, or is there like a time limit? Can't deal with a fighting type. Uh Crunch and Flamethrower are great stab moves to have on this thing. And apparently they get new signature moves too, which is good. So what's it gonna be? Another thing I already have? I almost just went down the ledge again. Do I have enough money? I hope I do. Unlike him, I sell rare Pokemon directly. Alrighty, here you go. A Geodude! We have not seen this before, chat. New Pokemon alert. Level 12. Fire Rock? Oh, jeez. It still dies if you spit on it, though. <laughs> if a Raindrop even comes into contact with Geodude, even in this universe. Defense, or er, Tackle, Defense, Curl, Rock Throw. So it's basically just the Colossal family now. I mean, cool I guess, but I don't think I'd want to use it due to that glaring weakness still. Um, okay. Now what was I doing? Come back here. <laughs> Maybe I should get some Mons out of the way for the Pokedex now. Just take them out of the daycare and level them up, and then put new ones in. Let's do that. Geodude can escape being a four times weakness. Regenius, does you want to see your Sandshrew? Your Sandshrew has grown a lot. By level, it's grown by 13. Chat, what level does Sand Slash normally, or Sandshrew normally evolve a Sand Slash? I recall. Your Ladybug's grown a lot, by level's grown by 14. This I should be able to level up right quick, so let's do that. Let me just check it. Please be close. Oh! Did I just have enough steps on the dot? That's an empty bar. What do we got? Thundershock, Shockwave... Let's go in here and do that then, why don't we? I could also surf down this way. Or good rod some Pokemon. It's also an option. Hang on. No, not old rod. Just use some electric moves and kill some mons right quick. 
There's also the trainers down there. I can beat up for the soft sand. Oh, I can get that for Poliwhirl. I should do that while I'm here. Crabby. Okay. You're not weak to electric, though, now. In fact, I think, weren't you part electric? No, you're... Okay, you're taking damage, so this is good enough. I'm just doing this so I can get this mon done and put new things in the daycare. Okay, it'll take a little bit. That's okay. Decent way of doing things. I also got to pick up the Eevee from... Oh, duck. I gotta pick up the Eevee from Bill. Um... Do I need new items for Leafeon and Glaceon, or can I, or does the Leaf Stone and Ice Stone work like they do for Sword and Shield? And I imagine there might be a new item for Sylveon. I'm gonna have to take this to the Pokemon Center. <laughs> okay. Almost there. I was hoping for a larger experience bar, but I guess I'm not that lucky. I wonder... I could just try buying a Leaf Stone and see if that lets me get Leafy on. Because, I mean, I'm going to have to breathe the Eevee regardless, but actually, no, Eevee's catchable in the wild now. Or it may have been before, but it doesn't matter. For now, can I headbutt anything out, too? Let's do that. All right. Here's the Anma. Let me put Shockwave up front there. I'm going to tie my hair back. It's actually getting really hot this time of day. Next three sub in there, friends. I'm trying to complete the Pokedex in this game, so I'm just kind of like evolving to Ledian and then getting rid of it so I can put new Pokemon in the daycare. The daycare is going to be very useful in helping me get some extra mons done. Hang on, I'm just going to take my headphones off and... Is that Magikarp? That's Magikarp. Wouldn't it be funny if I ran into a shiny one? I believe this is... This thing is... Oh, this thing's ground-type. It's a waste of time. Hang on. I appreciate all the subs, everybody. It's very nice. Okay. I'm not used to hearing how echoey my voice sounds in this room when I... Come on, I'm trying to... I'm trying to tie my hair back and I keep getting not a bite. When I take my headphones off, I can hear how echoey I am. Alright, now let me tie my hair back. Oh, it's long. Oh, it's another Magikarp. Alright then, heck- Oh, you know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna finish tying my hair back. How about that? How about that, chat? Because it's getting annoying. Alright. Here we go. I highly doubt I'm gonna get any worthwhile experience from this. But- Let's just switch it out. I'm sure there's... There's gotta be at least one speedrunner out there who has a clip of running into a shiny Magikarp while surfing towards the Red Gyarados. Somebody out there has to have had that happen to him. And that would be one of the funniest damn things in the world. Maybe it'll happen to me. Or maybe it'll happen to you. Also, this was a waste of time. You saw how much experience that was. Let's stick to the grass then, why don't we? I did not run into a shiny in the previous playthrough at all. The odds are like 1,024. Or 1 in 1,024. They wanted to make it rare, but not... At least make it statistically likely you'd find at least one in a casual playthrough. And considering I'm going for the decks, I, pr I should realistically find one or two, right? Hmm. Odd Egg is guaranteed. There's you again. 
I can't kill this either. You know, I'm just gonna run. Apparently, I picked the worst possible place to do this. Come on. Come on. Come on, chat. I want to get the soft sand. That would be very good to put on uh, Poliwhirl. Poliwhirl is surprisingly strong, even though its attack stat doesn't seem as large as the other Mons. It's got good stab. Giving that thing Earthquake later would make it a beast. Finally, more flying types. I thought this would be a lot faster, but apparently not. Didn't expect to run too many damn ground types while fishing. <laughs> Is it enough? <sighs> One more. One more. Ladybug's Pokedex entry said it was like a fun friend to have for campfires. People go camping. It would be nice to go camping, chat in the Pokemon universe. Imagine how many Teddy Ursus you could take with you. Camping out in the wilderness, Teddy's everywhere, and it's with you and nature. Okay, finally. This thing doesn't evolve. Okay, good. If I was gonna get some last minute we made it Thunderstone, I would have been annoyed. I would have been real annoyed. Is that a different sprite? Lenniba evolved into Ledian. It's still bad. It dances around the sky at night in patterns and formations to communicate with other Lydian. It is a little different? Okay. Alright, chat. We got it done. Okay. And now the save space. Where is it? We're just gonna release it. There we go. Bye, Ledian. There's the other- oh, this is the other Porygon. I can get rid of this, too. Um... I think someone said Onyx was level. I also- Caterpie is apparently, like, mid-twenties or something for Metapod now. So I should also put that in. I could put the Rattata in. Yeah, let me just put the Rattata in for now. By the time I come back for it, I should reasonably be able to do that. And let me check the Sand True. I think that's also going to be close. Rattata. This is going to help me a lot with training some Mons for the decks. I want to see your Sand True. Your Sand True's grown a lot. My level's grown by 13. All right. 22? Okay, that's still, that's still a few levels away. I can just put it back in. No, I don't feel like breeding the eggs right now. Put the sand shrew in. Alright, now let's take out a friendship mon. Both these I'm working on. Let's take Mantike first. I gotta go to the Salon Brother today, too. <laughs> now. Oh, it's daytime now. Morning's over. Okay. Now, let's go beat up the sisters. What do you want, Joey? Yo, how's it going? This is Joey. Got a minute? Let's get together and battle. I promise things will be different. Route 30 is where I'll be. Give me a shout. Collecting go is going just fine. We're making progress on the decks. Darn it. Check out that egg. I mean, duck. Why'd I say egg? I don't know. I can't talk today. You found some gold.
Ah, oh, someone found us. Now, what level were these people? Okay, Goldeen. Can I bite my way to victory here? Okay, now that's gonna make things annoying. That fish is definitely not okay. That fish is dead. Oh, this game does not want me to train this damn Charmander, apparently. Bite. It's a dead fish. It's definitely not okay. Okay, there we go. There we go. And here comes Seeking. Here, this fish is extra not okay. <laughs> Wanna throw up just looking at that. Okay, Ariados can come out. <laughs> it's just melt- it's just rotted. That's all that happened to it. No level up for Charmander. You have to switch next battle. Ooh, too strong. Can't, you can't beat Irene and go unpunished. <clears throat> what are you gonna do about it? Okay. And what's the next one you got? Okay, she's got Porygon, so is she gonna have Porygon too? So we'll find out. Okay, um... They can't use Ariados because of that. I'll just let Feraligator kill it, I don't care. Eevee's gonna be annoying because I'm pretty- because I got to at least friendship evolution for Espeon and Umbreon, right? I don't think they made the Moonstone Sunstone. And Sylveon might be a friendship thing too if they made it that way, for all I know. <laughs> I have Bite. Don't really need it on for Alligator considering the rest of my Mons. Porygon 2, yep. Um, can I get away with letting Poliwhirl do this? <gasps> it's a real duck! I kind of forgot about that. <laughs> he's got a little sailor cap too, chat. Don't think he's part flying, he should still be water normal. Oh, great, that. He's a real duck! Oh, damn, that did nothing! Come to think of it, why would Leafeon or Glaceon require Leaf Ice Stones if they're different types now? I have not considered that. Ha. Huh. I, okay, uh, maybe none of the evolutions evolved the way I think they do. <laughs> I didn't think of that at all. The duck is a sailor, and he wants to be friends. He wants to do a good job. The duck's getting speedy, but this plane is speedier. I will have one of those ducks soon enough. So sorry, Irene, sis. What? Charmander's evolving. Say goodbye to Charmander, chat. It's going away. Its sprite is now mid-slash. It wasn't like that before. Evolved in the Charmeleon. It sneaks up on Sleeping Prey at midnight and kills it with its sharp claws. It's nearly blind in daylight. All right. You sure were mean to my little sisters. Was Charmeleon like that before? I don't recall. Well, it doesn't matter. Can I get away with attacking it myself now? Remember it was slashing before? Okay, I guess I'm just misremembering then. 
Uh oh. Oh, come on. Give me a break with this crap. Alright then, fine. Poliwhirl gets it. Poliwhirl gonna slaughter. I'm not really gonna be able to train uh, Charmeleon on the ocean route to Cienwood. Send out Cloyster. Poliwhirl's gonna have a word with you. Oh, that thing. It turns to a sword. Shell. The tongue got larger, too. Ugh. Uh-oh. 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 I wasn't expecting that. Yeah, it's a Razor Clam now. Still got that massive physical defense, too. Finish it off. Finish it off. Give me the soft sand. Make Polly whirl a god. I don't think Polyrath would be as high as, like, level 40. Or at least higher than that. You know, I can't believe I lost. You're too strong. Didn't stand a chance. Here, you deserve this. Okay. I'm sorry we jumped you. We never expected anyone to find us here. You sure startled us. Okay. Let's take it. Wait, Soft Sand also works as an item? Does it evolve someone? I don't know why they have the use option on these now. Made Polywhirl hold the Soft Sand. I should also go back to Azalea later and get myself a Charcoal for um, Charmander. All right, let's head back. <laughs> Here comes another Porygon. Uh, give Poliwhirl his level up, please. I doubt it's gonna be 32. There's a rare candy near here. You mean like a hidden item? Don't remember hearing anything about this. In the trees of this island, quotation marks. Oh, I didn't know about that. Well, that's nice. I'll save that later. Okay, that's Rattata in there. Let's go back and heal. And we're gonna stop in the underground to use, uh, to give Mantyke more friendship. Heal me up. Check stream health. Excellent. Boop. Your Pokemon are fully healed. We hope to see you again. Don't we all? Oh yeah, the Eevee. I'm trying to have all this stuff on me right now, though. I can pick up the Eevee at any point. It's just gonna sit in the PC. Welcome, I run the salon. I'm the older and better of the two haircut brothers. Make your Pokemon beautiful. Would you like to do that? Okay, watch it become beautiful. And Tank looks happy. Okay, good. Now then, did I miss any trainers in the earlier routes? Don't think so, that's all of them. Well, may as well run in the park. No bug catching contest right now. Can Charmeleon kill things here, maybe? Could mess me up <laughs> with the fighting type attack. Can I get away with killing you? 
No, it just tackles me. Hmm. Where else can I go? There's the Slowpoke Well, and there's also Union Cave. Ah, uh, I could go there. Hang on, what does the game think it is right now? Saturday. I can't catch that thing down there, but I can change the date whenever I need to. Now let me head up here. I can also... Hmm. I can also start Rocket Hideout now, can I? That would be a place to train up Charmeleon and Porygon. Especially since I don't feel like going down the sea route right now. There's also the jungle route. There's plenty of places to go right now, isn't there? Super Potion. Let me demonstrate the power of the Pokemon I caught. There's plenty of trainers along Lake of Rage. Okay. Okay, this thing Charmeleon can fight. Oh, I can't buy Pokeballs in Mahogany, that's right, so... Okay, Charmeleon can't fight this thing, apparently. Charmeleon can't fight anything right now, today. Which is starting to get on my damn nerves. Come on. This won't do much. Okay, good. A lot of my Pokémon aren't really... They can't really sweep water types, can they? I don't have an electric type. At least Charmeleon burned the Quillfish, yeah. Not that that mattered too much, anyway. Fisher Tolly was defeated. What? That's not right. You can't beat me. I'm too good. Hmm. Well, let me heal up here now, then. Ah, oh, there's quite a few places to go, but the benefit of going to Chuck is that I'll get Fly, but... In this section of Johto, it takes like a second to bike everywhere now anyway. Like, I've opened up all the paths. Maybe, well, mainly just Siddle Widow you open up. Hmm. Well, it's not a big deal. Take your time. Ah, it's good to be outside. I feel so free. Well, the outside is nice, chat. It can be nice anyway. Hiker Benjamin would like to battle. Okay, this thing again. It's going to throw rocks at me and ruin my day again. So no Porygon. Charmeleon may lag behind right now, but that Charizard will be a beast. Oh, don't you dare. <laughs> well, all right then. Okay, Diglett's faster. I wonder if Water Gun would be enough to kill it. Yeah, it was. Okay, good. Charmeleon got a little bit. Oregon got a little bit. Okay, Onyx. Send it out. Can drown this with Surf. I think I remember Steelix. It looks gross. I wonder if they changed the sprite. Okay, special attack looking good. Don't trio. Yes, send it out. Porygon can take it. Oh, yeah, it's got a crystal for one of them. Uh-oh. Okay, it got five. It got five.
Okay, the Pokemon around here are actually a little higher level than normal. So they probably buffed them. Maybe I should leave the Lake of Rage alone for now and just go to the Cianwood. Hey, this is my secret place. Get lost, you outsider. Or at least we're getting some experience points here that I desperately need. Pokemaniac Shane would like to battle. Okay, Grass Dragon. It would still find a way to slaughter me, but... Yeah, once I get Fly, I'll go back to Azalea and buy the Charcoal. Ah, damn. Got Rock Throw. At least the Switch Out will guarantee a level up after this. Um... I'll let Ariados do this. Let's go. I should be fine to beat Chuck. It's just I don't have the greatest team to quickly train with the, off the swimmers in the, the C route. Hmm. Just trying to think if there'd be another Pokemon I could go catch right now to add to the team. Electric type would be nice. Another bug move on Ariados would also be good. Like, I'd take X Scissor if I could even get that. I'm pretty sure that, um... I'm pretty sure that normal Ariados can learn x Scissor, right? Let's see if I can deal with this. Charmeleon will get better. I only just got it, so it has no, like, effort values on it. Okay, good. I can two-shot. Oh, double kick. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Is there a Johto Safari Zone? I don't remember what's there, actually. I think that was a dev area, where you could just find a house with the devs and battle them. I should have used my stone. Charmeleon's Dark Fire, yes. It's based on a cave salamander now. So, let's just go back. They'll make a- yeah, if that guy's got like a level 27 Doug Trio, that this general area is probably a bit buffed and I should stay away from it for now. Whereas like in Vanilla Johto, everything around here is like this- Once you get to like Ecritique, everything feels like it's the same level for a good while, you know what I mean? Because you can kind of go in any order. Maybe I can find Heracross in one of these now. Nope. I'll try one headbutt encounter. Maybe I'll get a Yen, but at least set on fire. Level curve was updated in this update. Okay. Was it a significant change? I feel like I'm feeling like it is a bit different, yeah. You probably want to be doing things in the quotation marks intended order. Yeah, I know what you mean. All right, then. So let's go towards Chuck. Um, hang on. Any TMs I can put on... Would Shadow Ball work on Charmeleon? It does. I mean, it's special, so that's the main reason, but... There we go. Bite is physical, so... Just put that on for now. Um... And then there's that. What about Dig? Anyone else I want that on? Ariados can learn it too. I really need that, but... Wait, for Alligator can learn Dig? <laughs> um... That would be okay on him, but I didn't think that. He's a plane. Uh, Do I want to keep Protect, actually? Yeah, I don't need it, because I have Poliwhirl, but I might want to... Oh, come on. Good for dealing for the rock and electric types. That's, sh that's true. It gives me an out. I don't really need Bite, because Ariados has that covered, and now I have Charmeleon for Dark type, so I'll just get rid of this. So for alligator has a counter to its weaknesses. Okay. I can also just go the jungle area to try and get Charizard before I go the sea route. Yeah. Why not? Take a look around, chat. Take a look around. <laughs> right.
Right now, I'm still kind of building my team to carry me for a while. Excellent. I don't want to get destroyed by the gym. Well, Chuck's gym. I don't remember. I don't actually remember how that place went. I think they had that Hitmon, so they got coverage. For now, what's the decks looking like? Wrong thing. I own 30. A lot of mons to catch. I got to about 100 before we lost everything last time. Alright, let's try and get to Lace Leaf. How about that? Maybe I can find another team member around here. But I also want to carry something for friendship, you know what I mean? That's annoying. Uh, hi, Ekans. What type are you? Special defense fell. Okay, good. Sea snake, huh? Can't fight anything with Charmeleon here, can we? Probably poison water, yeah. Ah, oh, darn. Okay. The Pokemon in the jungle are quite strong. Want to see what I can do with them? Cool trainer Colby would like to battle. He's got eggs, apples. Okay, let's take it out. This I should be able to kill. Okay, good. Oh, that won't help you. That won't help you at all. I guess Execute's gonna evolve into an apple tree now. Would it just be pure grass, I wonder? I'm not sure. I never think I ever saw Execute or Executor last time. 48 special attack. Like, Charmeleon's stats aren't bad, but they'll definitely be really good once it becomes Charizard. Okay, Rock Poison on you. So, let me send out Poliwhirl and use Dig. Ground is how we get rid of this thing. Makes sense for it to have glare, doesn't it? <laughs> Ooh, that's a lot. Hit him on top. This thing was grass type, but also it's grass fighting, so Charmeleon would still get killed. I'm gonna send it out and switch into uh, for alligator. Okay. Level 27, and a fully evolved Mon, so yeah. I'm not gonna be able to get experience on the ocean, so... I'll take it, though. Oh, you know what I forgot to check, chat? I... Um... The Thunder Punch TM. The uh, Thunder Punch and Ice Punch. Uh... I could put those on some of my Mons. Like, for Alligator, having Ice Punch would be alright, but I can't really... Thunder Punch would count as physical, so I can't really put it on Charizard. Charmeleon. But maybe, uh, Poliwhirl would make good use of that. If they even still sell them as TMs in this game. There's an ancient shrine in Lace Leaf City. I found a rare dragon Pokemon there. Well, Trainer Bill sent out Kadabra. Ah, yes, Kadabra. Um, what type are you? Doesn't affect me. Nice. Okay. So you're not ghost. Probably part dark. But let me double check here. We try it. Okay, both dark and ghost. Not very effective. Can't remember what type this was. Charmeleon's getting better. You can definitely see the improvement on him. Nice, a crit. Beautiful. Damn. Good increase to its special. Kangaskhan, um... What was this again? 
Oh yeah, the like the clay figure. Was it ground or rock type? Let's find out. Okay, it's rock type. If that's the case, I'll send out Duck and use Surf. Oh, got Pursuit? Well, it doesn't matter, I can resist. Um, doesn't Charmeleon learn Flamethrower in its mid-twenties? I think that will probably be the best thing I can get out of training it right now. There he goes. This duck is actually working out real good for me, chat. Real good for me. Here comes Lapras. Uh, do I have an out for this? I'm gonna send out Charmeleon and just switch to for Alligator. There it is. The, dra the Hydra Lapras. It's like a 1% encounter in the shrine. I never ended up finding it, I think. Did the screen just glitch for a second there? Am I losing my mind? I think I'm losing- I think I just miss- like, saw something incorrectly, never mind. Got my screen glitched. Dragon Rage, fun! Wait, am I not using mock speed? Oh, okay, I was hitting it. Well, I'm probably gonna go down, but... I'll do as much damage as I can. Charmeleon can't get the kill because it's paralyzed and it'll die to a dragon rage. Uh, let Porygon get it, I guess. Kill it with Swift. Oh, damn you. I hate that. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't. That's right. That's a lot for a split experience. No, Lapras! Aw, oh, poor thing. Apparently Lapras used to be common, but it was hunted to near extinction in ancient times. The shrine where I found mine was made to protect the Lapras inside. Alright. Good for that. Got a Carbos. Um, who was the Slowmon on my team? Forty-four speed, seventy, forty-six, thirty-seven, sixty-nine. So Porygon and Ariados aren't super fast, are they? I should probably just use it on Porygon. It doesn't really matter, it's barely gonna be a boost anyway. Okay. Okay, another trainer, huh? I should ignore this one, though. Swine! It's a moss rock, chat. A moss rock! Can't escape. Oh, Charmeleon's dead. I should have taken it off the front lines. Okay. Actually, I just fight this guy. Couldn't I? Yeah, I don't have for alligator, but I should be fine. Shh, I'm hiding. What's he hiding from? Charmeleon had no EVs, and I got it at level 20, so of course it's not going to be as strong yet. Okay, this should be fine. Oh, good. The Protect game, chat. The Protect game. Everyone's favorite way to play Pokemon with the AI. Oh, he's going for the double. The double strat. What a genius move. Okay, he didn't go for the triple. Good. Nice. Damn. I wasn't so expecting a single Swift to almost kill it. I thought it would take it like, like down to half. Might be getting a Porygon 2 today if I'm lucky. Hitmon top. Um, 
Can my current Pokemon really fight that? <laughs> Ariados can, I guess, with um, Infestation. Try that. Not exactly my ideal situation. I'd like to have Exorcer for situations like this, but I guess I gotta get my level up. Yeah, it went to neutral. Okay, I thought I... I didn't remember that bug resisted, uh, or fighting resisted bug. Well, whatever. I can do this. Thought it was go- I thought fighting resisted ghost, but it resist bugs? Sand Slash, this is a dark type. Um, it should be fine for me to just spam Surf with Porygon. Let me do that. Look at that evil rodent chat. Regular sand is normal. I'm pretty sure this is normal dark. Because it looks like it, it got evil. Because uh, Sandshrew's Pokedex entry said it becomes a thief. That in this game loves to make everything part normal. <laughs> it's either part normal or it's part ghost. Yet I feel like I've barely seen electric types. Okay. Oregon's trying to learn Lock On. Don't really need Lock On, no. Camper Vito defeated. Don't rat me out. Don't I just blend in so well? Keep fishing up these dang snakes! Here comes a fisherman. Okay, so water poison was the, the conclusion we drew for this thing. I wonder what Arbok looks like. Probably cool. Swift has been a surprisingly good move. At least the normal type gives me stab for it. The only thing I'd probably also put on for normal is probably try attack, because that's like the only other uh, special normal thing that I'd want. Just give me some water moves and try attack and swift. That'd be pretty damn good if I, I say so. I wonder what Porygon Z looks like if Porygon 2 is like a normal, like, sailor duck. Guess we'll see when I get it. If the idea that Porygon Z gets corrupted, maybe it'll turn into like a pirate duck. <laughs> That'd be funny. Not getting much for killing these snakes, though. Oh, I remember this thing. It was like... Wasn't this thing, like, part dark type? It's like water dark, I think. Attack it. Quack. The duck exists. I hope it doesn't turn into another plane. It'll probably turn into an entire ship with how this game is. I need a cigarette. No, you don't. Not in my wholesome video game. These rivers are infested with Ekans. I don't know where they come from, but this is the only place to get them. Moss Rock. It just blends in, chat. And the swine just blends in. And it... Is, I believe it's pure rock, right? Yeah. I keep thinking it's rock grass because of the moss. I'm sure I'm not the only person. No, oh, come on now. There's Venonet. The Venonet, the thing I regret training. Kill with Surf. Almost there. Almost there. Almost there. Moss Rock. Give me level 30. At least give me that game. No friend, welcome. I wish it was raining for me. It's too hot out right now. 
I want it to rain, chat. More rain. No evolution. Lace Leaf City. A colorful tropical city. Who's this? I got lost in the maze last night. There's treasure to be found there if you know your way. Programmers were so lazy they forgot to make me until the day before launch. <laughs> oh, those lazy programmers. Mm. Where's the Pokemon Center, though? That's the road that leads towards Tumbleweed Town. My mom said that there are ghosts past the desert. I'm scared to go there now. Where is the... Okay, there it is. Cave here is a large maze where people get lost. However, rare Pokemon lie at the deepest end of it. There we go. Guess I can check out the shrine. Probably should buy some more Pokeballs now, though. There's some one-off mons I can catch in the in the shrine. Like Kangaskhan and Lapras. Oh, evolution stones. Don't need these right now. I can just fly back and get them later. But, uh, no Pokeballs here, huh? That's annoying. I read in a book that you should raise any Pokemon you catch with love and care. This apple was totally disgusting. You can have the rest of it. <laughs> okay, buddy. I don't know why you'd want my garbage, but whatever. I'm in this house. This maze is an archaeological wonder. I'm surprised there's so few people here. Jungle maze. Let's have a look around. Oh, one of you. Imagine it falls by Leafstone now. Wonder if I could easily catch it. Just give it. I could give it one level, and then use a Leafstone on it to complete its. Uh, okay. Here's a Pokeball. I don't really want to use Nido Queen. There we go. Grass Dragon. It's often mistaken as a mossy stone. It's as sturdy as the rocks it's confused with. Send to the PC. Alright, let's look over here now. Big Pearl. Well, stuff to sell later. Hmm. Nothing there. I can't remember what the odds are. Okay, there's you. Take a while to get Alakazam, so I don't need to bother too much with you right now. Alakazam's most assuredly level now, so I'd wait a while before catching one because I need to train it up a bit. Okay. I forgot that Gligar was a gargoyle now. Um, I think this is rare? I gotta catch it and evolve it now for Gliscor, but um... Is it a stone evolution or a brand new item, I wonder? 
Okay, let me go for the catch. Actually, let me send out Poliwhirl and put it to sleep. Let me do that. Mimic makes sense for it to have, I guess. Hmm. Okay, good. I'm having good luck with these Pokeballs today. Pure Rock. It silently watches over the homes of many trainers, but is often confused for an actual statue. Okay, perfect. So does anyone... What What is the evolution method for Weavile and Gliscor now? I actually want to know. If it be a simple... If it be simple to just give them a stone, I could get them out of the way easily and maybe even use one of them. Sneasel's the dragon bug as well. Oh, I can get a decent experience by hitting this, then. Do this. Likely a new stone. Okay, I wasn't sure if they just gave it, ex made it, like, a brand new item or something, because they have, like, their own specific items, the Razor Fang and Razor Claw. There's another one. They're pure rock, so this is a decent place to train, um, Porygon, I guess. I feel like Porygon 2 should be right around the corner. Where, like, where are all these new evolution stones? Are they, like, really late game, or do I have to get them from, like, a later shop or something? I think it's a new show, new stone? Okay. Thanks for summoning there, friend. Damn. There's a lot of Pokemon in here. I'll take them out with Porygon, and if I can run into Kangaskhan or Lapras here, I should hopefully get them out of the way and just catch them. As soon as you can use Whirlpool. Okay, fair enough. Gligar gave more. Nothing over here. I don't remember there being a second floor here. Oh. There's Tangula, too. Um, this is probably the only place to catch one. But do I want it right now? Well, I killed it. Good experience, though. I don't remember the second floor. Oh, what is that? What is that? Uh-oh. Is this a legendary? Double saving. Oh, no, it's Lapras. They just made Lapras a static encounter? Well, let's try and catch it then. Oh, great, the body slam. Just damage it and then send out Holy World to hip and use hypnosis. Okay, I got a crit. I wasn't expecting to do that. There was no second floor originally. Okay, this is so this is new. Okay, it's at red. Now it's time for Poliwhirl. Okay. Because I know this was a 1% encounter before, wasn't it? Is it still like that? Hopefully this is going to be enough Pokeballs, because I don't have very many. Oh wow, first try again. Damn. 
Can it add to the Pokedex? Severing Lapras's heads used to be a common quest. As a result, these Pokemon are now endangered. How could they? Sent to Bill's PC. All right. Hang on. I'm gonna run around and see if the counters are different here. Ugh. Moss Rock again. Right. Porygon died. Do I even have an escape rope on me? Not quite sure. Oh, there's Kangaskhan. Damn, come on. If I can catch this, that'd be another mod I don't have to worry about. No evolution or pre-evolution for these guys. Oh, right, pure rock. Okay, maybe that's a little too much. I don't think the sand tomb damage will kill, though. All right, let's see if we can go for another ca first try catch in a row. Mash A button. Damn it. Now the sand tomb damage should put it in the red. I came in here with barely any Pokeballs, and I'm catching a ton of stuff because of dumb luck. Oh, damn. Red and put to sleep apparently is buffing it real good today. As soon as a Pokemon takes its gaze away, Kangaskhan swiftly moves to kill it. Oh, it's rock dark. Okay. No, we don't gotta nickname it. Send it to PC. Don't blink. It's literally the SCP. It's that thing. Or a weeping angel, yeah. It's scary. Uh, oh! It's Piloswine. Okay. I guess if this is gonna show up... Um... How do you evolve this thing now? I wonder if I should just try and catch it now. Since I got an early evolution, I guess. I mean, I'm pretty sure you have to train it to a higher level to actually add Pile of Swine. It's a pile of rocks now. More Pokeballs. It's a new stone as well? Okay. Well, I guess I'll be getting these new stones eventually. For now, let's just catch them. Damn. Pioneers used to ride these babies for miles. That's right. <laughs> oh, get in the ball. I'm about to run out of Pokeballs. I gotta leave after this. I'll try the Great Ball. Let's go with that. We gotta get moving after this. Oh, come on. Yeah, I'm sure I can use Dig to get out. Alright, looks like this might be my last turn. Damn it. What is this thing's catch rate? I would expect uh, Lapras and Kangaskhan to be so much worse. Run now. I'm running out of stuff. Alright, I won't touch the controller at all. How about that? Damn. Oh, it's still asleep. 
Not using the Ultra Ball. You're not worth the Ultra Ball. <sighs> Alright, fine then. Free experience points. Pokemon Center. Alright, let me stretch. Now I need to go back to Olivine and buy a bunch of Pokeballs, because I have, like, none left. None left in all chat. I have nothing. Because I can't buy anything from this mart. I really need to have fly by this point, so I gotta go to Cienwood next. This round ain't, this round ain't that long. Let's get out of here. Oh, I didn't fight you? Such darling Pokemon. Let's show our Pokemon together at the same time. I didn't fight this trainer. I thought I went back and fought her. He has Clefairy dolls. Potato hamster. Look how round it is, chat. Look how round that hamster is. It looks like a potato. Fifty percent potato, fifty percent prep friend. Watch the words at the end. I don't mind losing. Okay, talk to Jasmine at the lighthouse, so that's good. All right, time to stock up on these bad boys. Let's just go with 26 of them for now. That should be more than enough. All right, now that we're set up for that, we're gonna need to cross the ocean. Char what could the Charmeleon do, though? these trainers. Came to Olivine by ship to see the sights and soak up the atmosphere. Being a port feels so different from Big City. Is this still the ba battle tower? Are you going to the battle tower? This is a secret, but if you win a whole lot, you can win special gifts. Okay, it's still the battle tower. The levels of Pokemon I want to use are all different. I have to go train them now. So does the battle tower just function the same, or is there anything special to it? Although you can't see it from here, Cienwood is across the sea. Yeah, it's functional. Think it's harder now. You have to warm up before going to the water. That's basic. Ugh, I never really wanted to use the Battle Tower. Swimmer Simon sent out Tentacool. Alright, I should be fine with this, then. Okay, Tentacles of I'm on, I can take out just fine, actually. So maybe I will be okay on the sea route. Pack is lagging a bit behind, but that's okay. Alright, maybe Charmeleon will be okay here. Maybe Charmeleon will be okay, especially since Tentacool and Tentacruel are like the com most common surf Pokemon. I don't think I'll be running into Mantine or Octillery out here. Okay, Uncle, I give. Cienwood is a good distance away from here. Alright, let's go then. Apparently I worried about training Charmeleon for nothing. This'll help, though. 
So Charmeleon's not really going to be able to do much at the gym, considering fighting types, assuming he still uses fighting types. For Alligator, we'll slaughter. For Alligator, we'll carry. And then he will become my personal jet plane. How about a quick battle? I will be flying everywhere in style, chat. I will just pop a Pokeball and then bam, instant plane. You can mock the, the design all you want. It's still going to carry me far away. Hmm. Send up for Alligator here, because Porygon's an annoying type for me to deal with. I need a TM for a good fighting move to kind of just stick on some Mons. That would help here. Come on now. Wing attack time. Swimmer lane was defeated. I lost that one. Trainers might be a bit of a waste of time. What do you want, Ralph? Hey, it's Uncle Ralph. What do you say to a battle with me? Good, you're going to do it. For a kid, you're quite agreeable. You call your mom sometimes, too. Damn, chat. I just remembered. Remember when Ralph would call me all the damn time in the previous playthrough? Instead, it's been it's just been like other characters now. I'm on my way to the Whirl Islands. I'm gonna explore with my friends. I'm sure you will. I'm sure it'll be just fine for you. Swimmer Kaylee's coming out. Shelter. Um, could I kill this with Ember? <clears throat> Hopefully get Flamethrower very soon. Good, good. 26. No flamethrower. Porygon. Alright, I'm just gonna let Poliwhirl do it. Hit him with Dig. I gotta remember to go back for the charcoal. That'll also help out Charmeleon. Where do you get the black glasses in Gen 2 again? I wonder if I get that. I'm sure Crunch would be good, but... Actually, can I... I can get Dark Pulse in this version now, can I? That would be way better on Charizard later on. Porygon can take a hit. Jeez. And I don't have the moves to really... I mean, I think I should really get a Thunder Punch TM for Poliwhirl. I gotta, like, fly back and get that after the gym. That would really help me out. That would be my electric coverage. Especially since Poliwhirl has to go... would go up against water types anyway, right? Well, it'll be a problem for him, so... Maybe Fire Punch on you, too. Sea King... Okay, maybe Charmeleon can do this. Let's find out. We're in a cave south of Blackthorn. Okay. <laughs> okay, two bites. Although I wouldn't want my Pokemon taking a bite out of that fish. It's only, only got Mud Slap. I'm good. Ooh, that's good. Charmeleon growing. Is that how you do it? Porygon would probably get slaughtered of fighting type Pokemon to as normal type. I'm just gonna have Mantike with me. I'm not really gonna use it. <laughs> I don't need to. My current flying type's way better. This counts as the Cienwood map? Really? Doesn't look like I'm close. Clam. Leveling up fast in these waters. Who would have thought? Twenty-seven. Ah, oh, slash. That's not what I need. That's not what I need at all.
Alright, let's check down here. Welcome to Ecritique, and before I forget, I'm just gonna do that right away. What's up? Need some medicine? Wait, what? Uh, uh, what? What? No, 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 I, I, I talked to Jasmine, right? No, I talked to Jasmine! What's going on here? You have to kill Chuck first? Is that new? Because that, that wasn't the case before, right? Across the sea to get here? That must have been hard. It would be much easier if Pokemon knew how to fly, but you can't use fly without the city's gym badge. If you beat the gym leader here, come see me. I'll have a nice gift for you. Well, let's get started here. I think it was changed in Heart Gold Soul Silver, maybe? My Pokemon and I are bound together by friendship. Our bond will never be broken. That's entirely on your trainer, too. Because it's just, you're, you're basically just like, mm, I don't need to tell him about the medicine. Oh my god, it's so gooey. I hate it. It's so gooey, chat. Uh, Just let for alligator do it, jeez. Your trainer is basically just like, I need to be, I need to get the gym badge before I help the Pokemon. I need to do that. Be nice if I could at least get the HM and replace Wing Attack with that. He didn't die. Oh, well that's gonna kill him. He crashed and he just splashed against the wall. Black Belt Yoshi defeated. This isn't real. This isn't real. And this guy's gonna have Hitmonchan. We martial artists fear nothing. You're gonna be fearing something in a while. Black Belt Lao. Yep, he's got Hitmonchan. Okay, he can probably mess me up pretty hard, so let's just send out... Yeah, let Porygon do it. Yeah, that doesn't matter. I should be able to kill him with a Surf, assuming I can tank a Mach Punch next turn. put strength on anybody, did I? I gotta do that now. I can delete HM moves without the aid of a move deleter, right? Pretty sure I can. Able, able, not able. Maybe I'll put it on Polyworld for now, then. Yeah, just get rid of Headbutt. and I can just delete it later. Words are useless. Let's your, let your fists do the talking. That is not how a real martial artist operates. That is disrespectful. This man is pure violence. Okay, this I, can, I know I can beat. Charmeleon growing up so damn fast today. It's weird how that's its tongue at the top hanging out there. Scizor... Oh, right, bug. Bug fighting, I should say. It might mess me up, but I can mess it up. If that, that, that doesn't kill me. I lived... Wow. Scizor has special defense, apparently. I'm not used to seeing one survive a frickin' fire attack. All right, I guess I'll just let for alligator slaughter it then. How about that? Oh, it used pursuit. Oh, give me a break. Everybody's got pursuit now.
and yet super effective. Well, I needed this 34, so we'll take it. Trying to learn Steel Wing? Um... Do I need that? Not really. Um, I could use it on... Ice types. I mean, I'm not- honestly, I'm not gonna be using Protect for anything. I tried to hang on to that, but I don't need it. May as well do that, I guess. He lost, chat. He lost. Okay, there's one more guy. Let's beat him before I go to the Pokemon Center. I guess it'd be useful for price, yeah. My Raging Fist will shatter your Pokemon. Crisis Gym is gonna have Ice Teddy's chat, and I'm gonna have to beat them up. Do you know how much that breaks my heart? Oh, there he is, the martial artist. Underground. His tail turned into a little mace. He's got a double kick. You can't kick mud. That's a waste of energy. <laughs> the lad's a little fighting type now. <clears throat> Pardon me. Oh, yeah, he's got more. Um... be faster if I just let Feraligator do it. <clears throat> I'm gonna let him do it, yeah. Because Smeargle ain't gonna give much experience points anyway, so... Feraligator has mostly just been a switch-in because Feraligator's stats are actually pretty damn good. Maybe I got one with good, like, IVs or something. Magmar? Oh. So, is Magmar poison fighting? Okay, Poliwhirl should be able to do this then. Ugh. Look how creepy it is, chat. I don't even want to imagine Magmordar. Oh, trying to mock punch. I thought Dig missed for a second. So, yeah, it must be poison fighting then. New Toxicroak just dropped. I got shattered. Alright then. Now we should have no trouble against the gym. I hope. I'm not sure if Smeargle's stats will be buffed, but it's no longer a sketch Pokemon, clearly. It has actual moves. Your Pokemon are fully healed. We hope to see you again! I guess I can leave with Charmeleon again. Why not? I should be okay. Pokemon may be able to use this. Everybody's got Pursuit in this damn gym, though. Waha! So you've come this far. Let me tell you I'm tough. My Pokemon will crush stones and shatter bones. Watch this. Ugh! Ugh! They're scared now, are ya? What? It has nothing to do with Pokemon? That's true. Come on, we shall do battle. What's he got? What's he got? Leader Chuck got four Pokemon. Okay, he's leading with Cloyster. Do I dare? I dare. Ooh, almost one hit kill. Ooh. Do you got mock punch? Do you have like a speed move? No mock punch. Charmeleon slaughter in chat. Charmeleon sweep. Smeargle. Okay. It doesn't look like Smeargle's given like much of any experience, so I'm just gonna let the gator take it out.
I like that this is a priority move. <laughs> it's slaughtering them. Leader Chuck about to use Hitmon Lee. Okay, water, fighting. Um, hmm. I wonder if I can let Ariados do this. How about that? Ariados hasn't gotten to do too much today. Bubble Beam. That's your water move of choice. Well, it certainly hurt a little bit, I'll give you that. Damn. Ariado's doing damage. Okay, what's my attack looking like now? 76, looking pretty good. Special defense is the lower one. Hitmonchan, okay. Didn't really have an ace, it didn't feel like, no. Um... I guess I'll let try and let Porygon get the kill, how about that? Team is mostly pretty well-rounded. I wonder if I should try and use the Teddy Ursa this time, chat. Maybe I should. Of course you go for that. Of course you land and get Dynamic Punch, you little scum. Okay, let's use Dig with Poliwhirl. How about that? But the bear would have to evolve. Would have to evolve, chat. Unless I can put the elemental punches on it to make use of its attack stat. I'm kind of... doesn't feel like I have a whole lot of special mons. Well, I guess Charizard's going to be that, and Duck is also going to be special for water. So, yeah, I guess I could get away with that, I suppose. Maybe the bear would be good. If I need electric coverage, just need to use Thunder Punch. Again, assuming I can get that damn TM. What? I lost? How about that? You're worthy of the Storm Badge. We did it. Now give me Dynamic Punch and I'll never use it. I still remember the time I missed 12 of those things in a row. It also lets your Pokemon fly when you're not in battle. Here, take this too. That is Dynamic Punch. It doesn't always hit, but when it does, it causes confusion. It causes confusion because you can't freaking believe Dynamic Punch hit you and ruined your run. I should get this out there, friends. You cross the sea to get here. I'm gonna cough here. Ugh, okay. I had to cough. I'm good. I'm good. Mmm. All right, let me just go ahead and teach this fly time. Manti can also fly me around. I may as well put this on over wing attack. Strongest physical flying move. Fly on the paper towel. No, doesn't deserve it. All right, so now I can check the, um, the side route. Hmm. No, I gotta get the potion as well. I could go right to Jasmine, but I can also check out the sides. Hmm. I mean, I have fly now, so I can go anywhere. I also tagged Mahogany Town and Laceleaf. Is something wrong? Give me the lighthouse. Poke yeah, give me the secret potion. There you go. My secret potion's too strong. I only offer it in emergency. There's also Mystery Man we can go and fight. Yo, Asprey. Wasn't that Suicune just now? I only caught a quick glimpse, but I thought I saw Suicune running on the waves. Suicune is beautiful and grand, and it races through towns and roads at simply awesome speeds. It's wonderful. 
I want to see Suicune up close. I have decided I'll battle you as a trainer to earn Suicune's respect. Come on, Asprey, let's battle now. You know what I love about you, Scene? I love how they make a big deal about this new character for Crystal Version and do nothing with him. This is like the last time you see him, right? Suicune is so cool. It would be awesome if I could have my own one. I gotta switch. Um, I'll go with Aridos here. Every super special third version character is like that. Heck yeah. We need new content, but it's only a quarter done. I don't care. Put it in there. <laughs> Alright. But I just started writing the character. Good enough. It said Weepin' Bell. Uh, Charmeleon should be able to do this. Like, this is literally the last time you ever interact with Yusin and Vanilla Crystal, right? He just shows up here, and it's like, whoa! But they made, like, a big deal of him back when this game was coming out. At least more in Japanese marketing, I think. That's weird. And they didn't do anything else with him in Heart Gold, Soul Silver either, didn't they? You can see him a couple other times? I don't remember. Magneton. Alright, send it out. It's a blob. It's a blob with eyes. Yusin wasn't even in the anime or movies, right? I don't think he is. Okay, in Heart Gold Soul Silver, you see Yusin a few more times. I don't remember. I hate to admit it, but you won. They didn't even give him an original overworld sprite. You're amazing. No wonder Pokemon gravitate to you. I get it now. I'm gonna keep searching for Suicune. I'm sure we'll see each other again. I'll see you around. It's Liz. Hey, Tanya, how are you? This is Liz. I'm fine, but I'm bored silly. Huh? Wrong number? Oops, sorry. All right. Let's check out over here. Actually, I should probably go back to the center. I could go cure the Pokemon, but I got exploring to do. Apparently he was in the anime? Really? I don't remember you seeing being in the anime, like, at all. That's strange. I know that even, like, the Pokemon Ranger protagonist, at least the first one, had a cameo in the anime. It's over here. It's that thing. Um, I haven't caught this yet. And it's only a one-time mon. I, there's no overquill in this game. I may as well just catch it and get it out of the way. Uh, yeah, I'll switch to Polymoral and use Hypnosis. some great balls. Apparently Yusin debuted, or sorry, debuted in the episode for Ho-Oh! The Bell Tolls. He's only in like two episodes. I don't remember ever seeing him in the anime, huh? Swimming too deep in quillfish infested waters may result in a nasty wound as they explode on contact. I wouldn't call that a wound. I would call that a, a lot more serious. 
I wonder if the PC is getting full. I gotta clear that up soon. I deleted some mons earlier to make some room, so it should be okay, but... Boxes don't switch automatically, so... You're getting there, Charmeleon. You're getting there. Charmeleon has already proven itself. It's good. Longing for others is what it is. But battles are battles, so let's go. And what's he got? Hiker Devon's got Dunsparce. This thing again. Only level 20? Expecting to jump by now. Uh, fire, steel, so this should be neutral. Mm. <laughs> oh, damn, that did nothing. I'm gonna take forever to kill, so I'll just let... Uh, actually, let Porygon use Surf on it. How about that? How about that? Duck is probably close to evolution. I wonder if the Pokedex entry for Porygon 2 is... Hmm. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the publicly available documentation for locations in this game is uh, for the older older versions, not for the new one. Alright. Keep sending it out. I'll let Porygon get this. It doesn't look like Dunsparce is a mon that gives very much experience. I don't suppose 31 is going to be my evolution level. He's got another one. Send out the Dunsparce, everybody. Send out the Dunsparce. Buried. It's just a little love in chat. Damn, though. Barely any EXP from that. Wahaha. <laughs> oh, Porygon's evolving. Nice. I got a duck chat. A real duck. Whack. Evolved into Porygon 2. These buoyant Pokemon are commonly found in whirlpools, but never quite reach the bottom. It's it's a rubber duck still. Quack. Okay. Oh, wow, yeah, its stats got a pretty decent buff, especially uh, its... Wow, its special defense is pretty good, and its defense is pretty decent, too, for its level. Okay, this thing's pretty nice. I wonder if I should try and get Poliwhirl to its evolution. It might be close. I feel like 35 is around where it would evolve, but 25 was, um, Poliwhirl. Well, Charmeleon's still gotta grow, too. I wouldn't mind a plush of that duck, too. Ducks are great, chat. They're little friends. And now I need a new item, apparently, for Porygon Z. But it's added to the game. Is it among the items I can get once I, uh, have Whirlpool? Because apparently that's when I get the new evolution items. Probably need I probably need like a dupe to use a dubious disc. Yeah, dubious disc freaking uh, as a use item. I don't know. I'm still confused why the mystic water and charcoal and that are um usable as well as holdable. Burn to the ground. Now I have no idea what Porygon Z looks like. It wasn't even in the old version. Alright, should be fine. Maybe I should let Mantite get some friendship levels now. The two of us aren't just some boring pair. I believe they are, Chad. I believe they are. 
I'm sure you, some of you know what it looks like because you've played this. Oh, I'm Rion. Well, it should be fine then. I can take this myself. Just bite the corpse, Mon. Just bite the corpse, Mon. Oh, I made it flinch. Nice. <laughs> Wait, how much did that do? Oh dear. Well, I won. Come on, flame thrower. Nope. I was open. You're unusual, too. One plus one is two, but the two of us together is much stronger. Wow. That's the lamest entrance of a duo I've ever heard. He's got a bug. Let's light it on fire. Kill it. Kill the bug. Oh, two hits, alright. It's still Espeon, so I guess it has special defense, but it's fine. Being part fire cancels out the weakness to bug, but that's alright. That wasn't what I expected. It's Mom. Hey, how are you? I found a useful item shop and I bought it with your money. It's in your PC. Um, does beating the devs in the dev house do anything? I don't really feel like doing that right now, because they all had shiny Pokemon, and they make, like, <laughs> kind of make, like, lame jokes when you're in there. I'm not that good with crowds, so I'm camping out here, my Pokemon. Are you the same way? I don't remember if there was actually something you got for beating them, though. Camper Grant got Skip Loom. Look at that, chat. A potato. Let's have some fried potatoes. Some tell from Charmeleon. Doesn't stop me, though. Potato, potato sprouts stand no chance. Meryl. Um, can I take it myself and hit hit uh, 31? I'd like to hope I can. It's only level 21. I don't think I'm going to be seeing Charizard today, chat, but... Charmeleon's working out. I like it. I liked it before, and I think its type gives me the coverage I want. Like, I seem to remember last playthrough, I complained about not having, like, a... Let's see what the duck looks like in battle. I complained about not having, like, fire coverage for a long while. Quack. Look at that, friend chat. Although, is it just me, or does the hat not look right? It, the hat does not look quite right to me. has little wings now. Hat looks like it's slipping off. Should be headed deeper into the mountain, I guess. Okay, I can't go up the waterfall. Looks like no dev room for me. Oh, Whirlpool. Is it past there? Where the new evolution stones are? Well, we'll find out another time. Let's see what's over here. Revive. Let's have a little look here, chat. Oh. Hi, Kabuto. Oh, it's got Aqua Jet. Uh, no, I don't need to do that. Let me just get Mantike some friendship levels, I guess, if it's needed. Kabuto normally evolves at level, um, 40, so I don't want to catch and train one right now. Like, it's easier to save up my money until I have the option to buy Ultra Balls. Then I can just, um, stick False Swipe on a Pokemon, and then just put him to sleep. And, uh... What am I doing right now? Let Polyworld do it. 
Yeah, just stock up on Ultra Balls and then come back and catch a lot of these, some of these Mons. I would probably have annoying catch rates. Hollyworld just picks up a boulder and crashes that, crashes it at Wooper. Alright, Mantyke doesn't have enough friendship. Let's see what else I can find here. I hope that Kabuno wasn't a 1% encounter, though. Mm -hmm. Trying to catch the one, like, the Pokemon that don't have, I don't have to breed or evolve, like Kangaskhan and Lapras, though. Getting those out of the way then and there is good. I don't mind taking the time to do that with my current amount of Pokeballs, but... Money can be a little bit tight because I want to buy the Kantomon every session. Because that's obviously something you want to get. Plus, I need the money to pick up uh, Pokemon from the daycare, too. So we can get those out. Oh, you again. I didn't end up catching it last time. If I, can get, it if I get it down to red, I'll try. I'll put it to sleep and try, but I'm not gonna... Oh, you're gonna use Glare on me? Okay. Okay, bro. Okay, bro. This thing's normal psychic. Because everything's part normal or ghost. I'm trapped. Trapped in a vortex. Okay. And I missed. And it looks like it's gonna die from the sand... The... The sand tomb. Either way, I'm getting a level up from this as well. I would love to get a cool shiny. I'm not gonna be using the, uh, the Mantyke, though. Like, it's just gonna evolve into Mantine, which is a flying normal type, and I have a way better flying type. Oh my god. Please hit Hypnosis. Please hit. Oh my goodness. Oh, good, it got the boost. Well, hang on, let me put the great balls up top. May as well give it a try. Remember, only sleep and freeze actually affect the catch rate in this game. Damn it. Taurus is another Pokemon. Like, I caught Miltank, but I don't have to breathe this, I don't have to train it to evolve it. If I can catch it now... I don't have to worry about finding it later. Damn. But Tauros just has a really bad catch rate. I hate it. It's really annoying when you remember that it was a Safari Zone Pokemon exclusively in Kanto. That crap was annoying. It's like I never used a Tauros in Gen 1. And then I later learned that Tauros is apparently just one of the d strongest damn things in Gen 1. I thought it was always crappy. Never used one, though, in that game, because it's... Catching one was just absurd. Gotta mash A button. Okay, thank goodness. Never have to think about Tauros again. Let's check the decks. An oracle. Lives high up in the mountains. It has a third eye under its big tuft of hair, but few people have ever seen it. Along with Snorlax and Chansey. Well, Snorlax is... There's two in the game that are stationary. Chansey is just a little piece of crap that I hate. No nickname. Alright, Bill's PC is probably, like, gonna be full now. It's gotta be. The fighting type sucks in Gen 1 since there's only, like, submission. So yeah, it doesn't have a lot of weaknesses. Now do it. Let me kill this so I can get... Okay, yeah, I was a little worried for a moment, and <laughs> that's not gonna hit me. Normal types were pretty damn good in Gen 1, weren't they? Maybe I'll keep that in mind when I do a Let's Go playthrough. I do want to do- I want to do a Pokedex run of Let's Go. That'd be fun. I think that would be very enjoyable. Be an excuse to play that game anyway. 34. No evolution. Okay, let's try one more encounter here, and then I'll, uh, surf over there. I think the Kabuto was a rare encounter. Oh, there's Pidgeotto. 
Well, there's only one Snorlax in Gen 2, I guess, yeah, but it doesn't matter that much. Hitmonchan was garbage in Gen 1 because it got the elemental punches, but they counted as special moves. It's like they didn't even realize what they programmed. I don't think there's anything else over here, but I can fly away now. Okay. It just tends to cool. Okay, there's a waterfall. Looks like that's it for now here. Hang on, let me put Mantike back to the bottom where it belongs. Uh, right, my gator is the one that flies. Um, where should I check out now? There's also the desert route to the side of Lacely, if I could check that out. There's trainers there. I can see if I can level up Poliwhirl enough to evolve. I want to say another level or two would make Poliwhirl evolve. I'm just That's just me being optimistic, though. We hope to see you again. I don't know how much friendship it's going to take to evolve this thing. Maybe I could check the lady at Goldenrod. Yeah, that would help. Charmeleon's getting up there. I specifically want Poliwrath because it, it, it's... Poliwhirl so far has been a great Pokemon for catching Mons and has... And Ground has apparently just been good coverage in this game. Okay. Earthworms. Hmm. Oh, a sandstorm active. Where are the trainers at? The sand is no match for my Pokemon. Dr. Bront would like to battle. Okay, he's got one of these. Not like the sandstorm gonna even do anything to either of us. Ground type too strong. Leech life. I don't want that thing leeching any life from me. Aw, oh, damn. Thought I could do a bit more than that. Perfect. Just checking something, chat. Alright, gonna stand up and stretch a little bit. I've been sitting all day. We're doing a long stream today. Did three hours of Ocarina of Time, and now we're pushing three hours on this soon. And we got a chance to upload the last episode. Star you? I don't remember what this is. That, I definitely have not seen before, unless it's a new sprite. What the hell is that? It's not a star anymore. Couldn't take that. I think it's ground type at the very least. Not sure about secondary types. They added its eye to the sprite. It didn't have that before. I don't remember what old star you looked like if I saw it. It's a sand dollar. Oh, I guess it is. Kangaskhan. Alright, this I can deal with. I just gotta go underground. When I get Earthquake, the Polyrath will slaughter chat. I'm actually really curious to see what Polyrath looks like. I've never been so excited to use a Polyrath in my life, because I've never used one before. Let's try to pursuit. Ooh, a critical hit. Okay, good amount there. I hate sand. Ground, rock, and steel Pokemon are impervious to sandstorms here. Nothing down here. That's a Natu. This might be the only place to find one. Not in a big rush for it. It's ghost type, that's right. 
Oh, I forgot to check the PC system. I might be full. I saw things in Tumbleweed Town that scarred me for life. I'm sure you did. I just wanted to fight a couple trainers here. I'm worried the PC might be full. This is poison type. I can deal with this. Hmm. Let's hope level 35 is good enough, chat. Let's hope it is. Tini, send it out. All right. If this doesn't give enough, it's not gonna. Okay. This will definitely put me over 35. I want to say this will be enough to kill. Good. Alright, game, please. Let me evolve. Body slam. Um... Chat, that has higher power than strength, right? Right? I mean, I can always... Oh. Oh, wait, what? I thought I, thought I could replace HMs in this game they change that, or am I thinking of a different game that did that? It might be a different game that did that. Oh well. Nobody believes me. Tumbleweed Town is real ghosts. I swear I'm not lying. I guess this game didn't have that. There's Goldeen. a dead fish in the desert. Oh, and I didn't evolve. Oh, well. Penny Brown, let me do that. That's right. I caught a rare bird Pokemon in Kanto. Want to see? Teddy was a wholesome game. Let me do a lot of things. A rare Pokemon from Kanto. Oh, yes. You. You're ghost type, though, right? I can't hit you. Yeah, you're probably ghost flying. I literally can't hit anything. Ugh, and of course you get that. Of course you get that. I'll let Charmeleon bite you. That's what you deserve. Sandstorm rages. Good, it killed. I can give a whole lot. It's only Murkrow, I guess. Pidgeotto. Okay, that'll be annoying. Um... I guess I'll just let Feraligator do this. Sandstorm may be raging, but it doesn't matter. Feraligator's carrying this damn team. It doesn't even need to fight much. <laughs> Rather, the team's doing well on its own. I don't need to, like, rely on my starter as much as before. I think I picked much better mons to use this time around. Bero. Okay. Um. Let Ariados do this. Hopefully, it doesn't, like, uh, mess me up hard with frickin'. a hard flying move. We'll see. It's only level 24. Oh, Aerial Ace. Okay, I barely did anything. I'm good. Good. The glory of bird Pokemon has been besmirched. One day you should visit the Kanto region.
Okay. There's water here. Anything special I can get with the rod? And the super rod is still in Kanto, right? The same place you get it in Gen 1. I don't remember. I never remember. And it's Magikarp again. Can't escape. It's Magikarp. You can escape. Even if you're paralyzed, Poliwhirl. Come on. Come on. Come on! Paralysis makes this so annoying. No! It's too fast. It's hunting me down. Okay, fine. Alright, Os, you get up front. How about that? I think that's all the trainers here. Oh, what's this? TM9. And TM9 is... Which one is that? Psych up? Blah. Hello, Joey. Yo, how's it going? This is Joey. Got a minute? My Sentrant's looking sharper than before. I doubt there's a Pokemon as cool as this guy in your party. I thought about going for it, but I decided to work my one and only right to the extreme. Alright, chat. I was in the middle of training my Poliwhirl, but, um... Now I feel like putting somebody in their place. Time to fly. First, let me go heal. We're gonna heal you to perfect stats. That's what we're gonna do. That's what we're gonna do, chat. That's what we're gonna do. Thank you for waiting. Your Pokemon are fully healed. We hope to see you again. Hmm. I'll put the duck up front. I've been waiting. Let's battle now. Let's battle. Let's battle. Show me the cool. Po show me a Pokemon that's cooler than anything in my party, Joey. Go ahead. I dare you. Oh, wow, that level 6 Sentret there, chat. It sure, sure can't hold a candle to me. Dead. Youngster Joey was defeated. Oh, I lost again. Doggone it. Get your money. I'll ring you whenever I get the urge to battle. And I'll show up to make sure you remember who's the strong one here. Route 4? That's in Kanto. Now then... Where else was there to head to? There's still more swimmers I could beat up in the ocean at the, the routes here. There's also the route towards the Lake of Rage where I can beat up some people. Don't feel like going into Ruins of Elf right now. I still want to see if I can... I just mainly want to see if I can get one more level on Poliwhirl and see if 36 is enough. Oops, why'd I go here? Hiya, kid! I see you're new in Mahogany Town. Since you're new, you should try Yummy Rage Candy Bar. Right now, it could be yours for just 300. Oh, fine then. I'm gonna block this path without any good explanation. You can't go this way. Can't believe they've been getting away with that for, like, 20 years. I can do so much with my Pokemon. It's super fun. Wait, does this route look different? This route looks different. I shouldn't have had to gone this far to find the camper. Send out the duck. Yeah, you have to go through the gate now. Oh, I don't want to do that. Well, for now, that's fine. Let's let Poliwhirl do this. I should be able to train more in the ocean around Cianwood. Gig, 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 gig. Here we go. Underground. You'll never see this coming. 
Wow, damn, that did nothing. And now, I can't switch. Well, now I want the sand tomb damage. Let's take it. At least you'll probably give good experience. Yeah, the level's actually jumping a little bit here. Probably where I was like my highest leveled mon right now, too. Here comes faint attack. Throw a boulder at him. Spencer about to send out Golbat. Okay, should be able to hit that. That looks slightly different. I think like the, uh, th like it wasn't that, uh, Dark Eyeball last time, right? Now his Crobat looked different. I still don't want one. I still don't want one again. Finish him. Ooh, almost. All right. Oh, yeah, gotta go through the gate. I didn't want to dig, I wanted to fly! Hmm. Yeah, let's go back to CM with right now. Just beat up some of the swimmers in the sea. <clears throat> Just make their Pokemon faint so they have no emergency rescue. People just out in the middle of the ocean swimming is, like, one of the most messed up things about the Pokemon universe. Like, that is just not something you can... that's humanly possible. <laughs> but they'll be there. All day. Forever. At night, they gather near the water's surface. Well, find... find that thing here at night. Tell you drown. That's a horsey chat. Is electric? Is that supposed to be like a little spark? And I forgot to put a uh, polywhirl up front. Duck can still kill. Duck can still super kill. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna try 36, and if I don't evolve, and I'm done training it for this episode. I hope it'll be enough. Should be seeing if it's weak to ground. All right, the moment of truth. Come on. No, it didn't evolve. Okay, we're not high enough yet. Okay, then. Ariados needs some more levels. Let's put you up front. Ariados has been really good, even if it does fall behind in level. So it'll be even better if we can keep it trained. Oh. Well, I guess I don't have to wait for nighttime for these things, do I? Ocean trainers aren't that good here. Are you seeking the secrets of the World Islands? Not really, I'm just passing through. Swimmer Matthew would like to battle. He's got Krabby. He just floats on the water. Shadow Punch it. Oh, it's part normal type. I should be used to this by now. What is it, electric normal? Still in the ocean, though? Ah, <sighs> and now I gotta cure the paralysis. I don't know who you think you're hitting with guillotine. doesn't even affect me because I'm ghost-type. 
The AI is just going for it anyway, though. Never mind the fact that I'm a higher level. Okay, that was surprisingly good experience for a Krabby. Uh, right. It's not a paralyzed heal. good. Charizard's still probably 36. We'll get it good enough. The ocean route layout's definitely different here. The weather's so beautiful, I'm in a daze. So next time, I probably should go to Union Cave and uh, catch the thing down there. I th I'm definitely going with Porygon 2 this time as my water type instead of um, training up that Machamp. Even though, like, the the Machamp was pretty damn cool. I liked it a lot. It was probably one of my favorite mons, but I don't really want to double, like, double up on the water types again. I feel like going with the duck should be fine. I mean, this is a Pokedex run, so things are gonna be changed, like Pokemon are gonna be changed in and out all the time. I mean, Kanto, I'm probably gonna have to keep my trainer team, because most ROM hacks like to change the Kanto gym leaders to have actual, like, have act actually be like bosses you're, you're expected to fight after the Elite Four and not just have lower level mons like they do in vanilla. Doc also has a new fancy evolution, that's right. It's super fancy. Let's get you some experience here, Ariados. The waves are wild. They tire you out while you swim. Well, you better be careful out here. Be a shame if someone, like, made all your pets pass out. I don't regret using the duck. It's been nice. He's a very nice friend. <laughs> it's going to bite me. It's going to kill me. <laughs> I just, I'm gonna miss the Machamp. The Machamp was really cool, chat. It was really cool and really freaking strong. I think I put Thunder Punch on it as well, didn't I? <clears throat> but there'll be other Pokemon we can also try, too. <clears throat> Pardon me, jeez. Like, obviously, I need to train up my main team for the Elite Four, but... I feel like throughout Kanto, I can change up my team a bit. Maybe. I mean, I, I kind of wouldn't mind changing out for uh, something cooler to replace my starter, because, you know... It's kind of a- it's- it's- it's strong, but it's not very for alligator's not very cool, chat. I don't really like its final evolution. I like the idea of the Totodile and Croc and all, but then it just becomes a plane and it's just like, okay. Okay. It's a plane now, because... Alright, you're level 33. Probably put someone else up front. Charmeleon should get some now. <laughs> if you need to rest, just tread water. You'll get your wind back so you can keep on going strong. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Man, Tyke is just behind me, slowly building up friendship points. Friendship evolutions are so dumb. I gotta make sure I use the haircut brothers, like, every time, every episode. Near the start there, I made him flinch, good. <laughs> Charmander has become your starter now, that's right. I mean, I probably could just keep the Charizard and, and box the, the plane at some point. <laughs> it certainly seems easy for me to keep my level up. I uh, can also train at... what is it? Oh yeah, friend balls. Forgot about those. I mean, really? Is the effort of getting Kurt, like, Kurt to make balls for you worth it, though? Never really feels like it. Critical hit. There you go. <laughs> not to mention a friend ball is not a guarantee when you throw it, either. Not unless I can buy the current balls from somewhere. Oh, you have more energy than I do. No 
Okay. There's more tentacle. We can easily take these out. I feel like Charizard would easily over end up overtaking uh, for alligator anyway. I mean, what does for alligator do for me right now? It it's a good Pokemon to use fly, and it does stab fly damage. It doesn't like I can give it coverage, but I feel like it's not going to be like the best thing in the world long term. There we go. Okay, that's the end of that there. <laughs> this area is definitely different. Okay, I keep forgetting to check the, the PC. I need to know how much I got in there. Thirty-two. Sixty-eight. And still... No flamethrower. Round 41. <laughs> Anything else down here? Is there an area I route I already took, wasn't it? Or did I go in that? Bite it. Fly is probably the best stab for alligator is gonna get. Yeah, that's also true. It's not really gonna... Jeez, yeah, that's right. It's gonna have better attack stab, but that's just gonna make it, like, equal out. Because it's not gonna have a better stab, like, physical flying attack. Damn. Oops, I ran from this one. <laughs> okay. I think this is enough of exploring the ocean for now. Let's take a bite out of him. Take a bite out of that friend. Make them suffer. So next area I should go to is probably... Well, it doesn't really matter too much. Hmm. Mahogany, or... There's also beating Jasmine. I should also get that out of the way. First, though, let me take a quick look and see what's in my PC. Thank you for waiting. Your Pokemon are fully healed. We hope to see you again. Okay. How full is the box? 18 out of 20. Okay. And they're all still there, right? Yeah, they're there. They're there. I'm not gonna worry about them too much. Um, honestly, I can just delete the giraffe. There's no reason for me to really keep that one right now. It's kind of common in National Park. <laughs> Alright, so I can catch three more Pokemon in there. Let me go to Goldenrod, so I can take a quick look at, uh... Hang on now. The friendship person. Deleting them, deleting them myself before the game can do it. Yes, that's right. I want to see what they say about Mantike. How close is it? I'm not sure what it exactly needs to say, though. You treat your Pokémon nicely, they'll love you in return. Oh, let me see your Mantike, it's friendly towards you, it looks sorta happy. What does that mean, chat? Is that good? Or is it, like, not even halfway to what I need it to be? Not happy enough. I'm sure it's not enough. It never is enough, is it? Shiny paper towel. Better than the leading brand. 
Well, it's a no duck for this. It's about, it means 150 to 199. What do I need it to be for, um, in order to evolve? Like, what, what's like the friendship Pokemon threshold for that? Threw it in a battle for no reason. It needs to be 220. Okay, so it's getting there, but it still has a long way to go, more than likely. What does she say when it's, like, over 200? Well, for now, chat, this seems like a good place to stop. Let me see here. Playing it for 10 hours, and we've only been playing it this week. We save in the game, and... We've caught 37. Not bad. It really trusts you or something like that. Save again, because we paranoid. Alright, chat. So this, is, this has been fun. We've been making good progress on this playthrough lately. Hope you're all enjoying. We've already been able to see a handful of... What do you want, Ralph? I'm trying to do the outro. Hiya, it's Uncle Ralph. You taking good care of your Pokemon? You have to be good to your partners. Just beat a wild hop if I told my kid, but he scoffed that he could do the same thing easily. Your kid's right. Boy, has he gotten cocky. You can call your mom sometimes, too. Let me save so he doesn't call me again when I boot it up next time. Okay, Ralph just had to get in there. All right, then. All right, chat, this is where we're going to end it. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed. We're going to make more progress next time. Um, we got the spooky creepy pasta stuff done today, so I could put that in the thumbnail. Um, I got a handful of, uh, single mons taken care of. That was good. There's still quite a bit of evolutions I'm gonna need to take care of, but I mostly spent time building the team today, didn't I? I think the team's looking good. I mean, I'm more interested in having a Polyrath than, a uh, playing for Alligator, though. Charizard's probably gonna replace it, honestly. Honestly, I'd probably replace for Alligator with the, with the bear. Yeah, I think that's probably the best thing. Why not? Anyways... Hope you all enjoyed. Have a good night. Bye-bye.